Hello YouTubers, Bear Geeks and Bear Hounds alike. Bill, here we're going to do a beer review. Alright. <clears throat> this one is by Black Plague Brewing and it's called Tony Hawk Birdhouse IPA. And they're from Oceanside, California. And uh, this puppy comes in at... 6.5% alcohol by volume. I've never had this before. I've seen it before, but I never grabbed for it for, so re for some reason. But I uh, did to this time. Probably because there's no date on it. So um, I asked the guy um, when it came in. He said it came in like about a week ago. So it's probably pretty fresh. Uh, I got it at Total Wine and More for like uh, two bucks for this one 12 ounce can. Okay. Pretty neat looking can, I must say. Very cool. So, um, let's, let's see if there's literature here. No. Black Plague Brewing. Oceanside. Birdhouse IPA. Tony Hawk. Alright, well. Let's get it cracked open and see what we got here. Looks like a West Coast style, for sure. Cool. They had a 12-pack of this for, I don't know, like 11-something. Looks like we're going to be here for a minute. Tony Hawk is a either, a, I think he's like a skateboarder or something like that, or... Uh, BMX something. I'm not sure exactly who Tony Hawk is, but I've heard the name before. Six and a half percenter. All right. I don't know what side I like more. I think I like this side actually more. That side. But this has the font in the front, so we'll go like that. All right. So we have a monster, frothy, creamy, silky head, a little foamy there. Uh, a lot of bubbles popping open in the middle. All right. And uh, we have a ever so slightly hazy amber color. Just slightly hazy, but more on the clearer side than a hazy. You see? Mm -hmm. We're good. An aroma on this puppy. Well, let's check this first. There you go. I can see real good through it. Definitely not a hazy. It's definitely a West Coast style. Let's get a aroma on this puppy. Hmm, big pine notes right up front. Yeah, nice piney floral. A lot of floral and pine. Really nice smelling pine though. Yeah, floral. <clears throat> Honestly, it smells like Pliny the Elder. It really does. A little malt kind of sweetness coming through. Uh, it's really good smelling. Let's get a hit. Cheers. Mmm. That's very tasty. Mmm. <clears throat> Tastes well as the aroma. Um, very, very tasty. I'll, right up front, I'll tell you right now, this is tasty. Look at the head. It is super creamy. Mmm, that is good. Damn. This is a piney one. Very piney and floral. Um, uh, it's pretty straightforward, actually. I mean, that's about what you're getting. Yeah, very nice. It's a balance of the um, piney, and nice malt backbone, and uh, some floral notes. It's very good, very tasty. A lot better than I was expecting. Maybe a touch of some earthy 
hop notes in there, but mo mostly just pine. Really, it's awesome tasting. I'm enjoying it. Um, so um, we'll let it heat up a little bit, drink on it for a little bit, and we'll be right back, okay? Alrighty, I'm back. This beer is pretty dang tasty. I'll tell you that right now. This is awesome. Um, I would consider it a budget beer because it is a good price for the six pack. So this is one of the better budget beers, I would say, that I've had. I don't know if this is year round or not, but I'm not sure. But the guys told me it just came in and now I see why they told me. Really tasty. So it's just a really nice balance of the really excellent malt backbone and the hops. It's almost like hop pine oil almost like that. It's it's really tasty. Um, it's a lot better than I was expecting. And all the floral notes in there. Really nice medium smooth mouthfeel. I mean look at the head. Really nice lacing on the glass. They're really thick though. Really really good. I enjoyed that. Uh, I will be buying this again. I'll probably buy the whole six pack though this next time for sure. This would be a really good session beer. It's only six and a half percent, so good enough for sessioning. Crushable, totally crushable. So um, with that said, on a scale of one to five stars, I'm going to give it a 4.3. It's that good. This is one of the better West Coast style IPAs I've had in a minute for sure. And I'm not just saying that because of Tony Hawk. This is actually a very good beer. Okay, so 4.3 it is. That's my story. I'll stick with that. Uh, this puppy gets double horns up. It's pretty darn tasty, man. And uh, if you see this, you get it fresh. I would definitely go for it if you're a hop head. You like piney kind of hops. So uh, thanks for stopping by. Hit like, subscribe. I'd really appreciate that. And uh, we'll check you later. See ya.